Wow. Hell hath no fury. Hmm. Did it ever get that bad with either of your exes? No, no. Both my divorces were amicable. Yeah, a little too amicable. So something was going on with Michelle Tui. On the morning of her death, she arrived to court late and she had been crying. So where was she coming from? Well, according to her financials, she paid for breakfast at a cafe right before court. So maybe someone there will let us know what was so upsetting. Bro, what was that? What was what? Your girlfriend just uttered a sarcastic remark about your ex-wife, and all you're gonna say is, what was what? Oh, that was nothing. Spit it out. Tell us. Uh, okay, uh, as you know, Beckett is staying at the loft. All their places getting fumigated. Alexis is homesick as well, and then Meredith showed up, and she said she wanted to stay in the loft. And you said no. Tell me you said no. Why? Really? Letting an ex stay with you when you're with someone else. That's like throwing gasoline on fireworks. Come on, guys, it's not that bad. Castle, you are on the edge of a very, very steep cliff, my friend. And if you don't do something about it quick... So the cafe owner remembers Michelle having an argument with a tall, good-looking man, mid-30s, light brown hair, and blue eyes. Her boyfriend, Corey Francis? I thought he said he hadn't seen Michelle since the weekend. Now, why would he lie? Looks like he's hiding something. Let's bring him down here and find out what. Affiliation. All right, you guys keep digging. There's got to be a connection somewhere. Hello? Hey, uh, yeah, Meredith. Yeah, Castle's right here. I'm sorry, what? You want to talk to me? Uh, yeah. No. Okay. Fine. What does she want? She asked me to dinner tonight. Just the two of us. To dinner? And you said yes? How could you say yes? Same way you did when she asked to stay with you. Besides, Castle, if I said no, that would have made me look insecure. Is this as bad as it seems? No. It's much worse, much, much worse. No, OK, hang on. Let's take a step back from this. Let's just think about it. Just dinner. Just dinner between your ex-wife and your new girlfriend. That's deadly. Castle, you have two worlds. Two. Right now, they're both coming together. Uh-oh. What happens when worlds collide? Boom. OK, guys, you are taking this a little too far. Castle. Meredith knows things about you. So? So. So. So is there anything Meredith knows that you don't want Beckett to know? Boom. Two worlds colliding.